everyone, I'm KR and this is my feline son Jarrett. And this is just an impromptu video on my iPod. And I just want to talk about depression. And the reason it's impromptu is because I'm feeling that right now. And I haven't felt this way for a really long time. Like this. But the thing about depression is when you're not feeling it, you feel like you're fixed and like you're okay and like maybe that will never happen again because you're over that, you're past that, you're better. But you very well may feel that way again. And it's because depression, manic depression, it doesn't happen for a reason. And because it externally it doesn't it's not triggered by something externally necessarily. And because of that, it doesn't have a fix. <laughs> but that that's okay. Because it's a part of me and it's a part of you maybe. But when you do feel that way, when you, you do get into a depression spot, it can feel like you'll never get out of it. Like you're broken and like you can't feel anything. Or like you can only feel sadness and like there's this black hole dwelling in your chest and there's nothing you can do about it and you'll just keep swimming in there forever. But you won't. Because just like when you're not feeling that way, it feels like you'll never feel that way again. You won't always feel that way. <laughs> and yes, it hurts when it feels that way. But it's the way you feel. And I think feeling anything is something. <laughs> Even if it feels like in that moment you're feeling nothing, which a lot of the times depression feels that way, but it just kind of makes the times you feel other things so much more powerful. We can appreciate the highs more than people who don't have lows like this. And we can also, we can also appreciate people who have lows like this in ways people who don't have lows can't. And it's not a bad thing that you've done if you feel this way. It's, you're not a monster. You're not, there's nothing wrong with you. You don't need fixed. And that's another reason why there's not a fix. It's just something that happens. And that's okay. It's okay. Just do what you need to do to get out of it because part of the thing that depression does is it makes you feel like you'll never get out of it and therefore you're like you you don't try to get out of it because you feel like it's pointless but there are things you can do you can call someone you can draw something you can do something that you love even if you feel like you don't love it anymore fake it like you make it, as cliche as it sounds. And sometimes you can't do that. You can't fake it even. You just can't. And that's okay too. But there are special little moments in between the times where you can't because your mind won't let you and you just can't. There's moments after those that might feel similar but you will be able to you might have to force yourself a little bit. But if you force yourself to do it, there'll be more times where you f feel like, oh, maybe I can do it. And you will. And you'll slowly climb out of the hole that is depression. And you might be there again, but each time it might be a little bit easier to get out of it. You might not stay as long as the last time. And it might be longer it might, might, might take longer for, the, for you to feel it next. And if you feel it, 
it's okay, you didn't do anything wrong. There's nothing you did wrong. It's just the part of you and all of you is lovely. Find ways to love yourself. And I know that's hard. I know it. I feel it. But there's always something that you can find. I care about you all and I just... I wanted to make that video. <laughs> this video, I guess. Um, and... I didn't necessarily feel like doing this before I did it, but now I feel a lot better. And hopefully it might make you feel a little better too. I hope any of you who feel oppression feel heard and feel loved and feel not not as alone. And I know your symptoms may be different and some of those things might not be completely you. This is just me. And it's okay if you feel different, just like it's okay that it affects me differently. And if you don't understand oppression and you don't really get it and it feels like nothing, it's not. It's this huge thing that's happening inside of us. And you won't be able to fix it. Just be there. We might tell you to leave. <laughs> we probably will. Just be there. Maybe make a little blanket fort <laughs> and just cuddle in it. Don't try to talk us out of it because we don't, we didn't, we're not there on purpose. Just be there and we won't be able to tell you what's wrong because externally there's nothing wrong. There might not be anything wrong. It doesn't always seem logical because it's not, which is why there's not just like one magic fix, just love them. And hopefully this will help you do that a little more. Alright guys, I'm gonna say goodnight. It is 10.07. <laughs> I care about you all. Bye guys, it's good to know you. <laughs> Goodbye from Jay. Okay.